if you think YouTube is on easy mode, it's not for you. Now, I wasn't going to say anything, you know, but I have seen a lot of easy mode videos floating around YouTube. A lot of the videos are from people within the community. I ask y'all to be authentic and relatable. And I, I don't feel like a video like that is relatable. Because you saying or someone saying that it's on easy mode and it's hard. It ain't really just, put it this way. Let's say somebody came to your channel for the first time, right? First time they seeing you. Remember, you're trying to grow. You're trying to grow. Let's say it's their first time coming to your channel and they stumble upon the easy mode video. But then they see you struggling. You think they're going to trust anything else you say? I know it's a trend, and it's okay to go with trends, but the trends have to be relatable. We can't just be saying things, saying that YouTube's on easy mode when it's not easy. Or if it is easy to you, okay, kudos to you. Kudos. It's not even easy for me, y'all. It's not easy for me. So to see some people whose uh, views are a little lower or whatnot, Less subscribers say that YouTube is on easy mode. I almost feel offended because I, you know, I sat back and I thought about it, and I was like, "Hmm, who are they comparing? E you know, YouTube being easy to?" And I know, you know, recent, including me, recent YouTubers uh, have you know gained a following or whatnot. But I say I'm offended because it's like, wait a minute. So y'all telling me that all that hard work I put in was easy? I, I keep on saying it, eight years. Everything's just now really starting to pop off. So you're going to say that everything I did was easy? I feel like, well, I ain't saying y'all, I ain't saying everybody feel that way, but I feel like that it's, discred that it's discrediting YouTubers who's been doing this for a long time, losing sleep, stressed out. And it's people that's been making content two months, two weeks. Saying that YouTube is on easy mode. Show me the proof. Or let me know who like who came up with that. Like like my keep posting video, for example. Yeah, I ask people to duplicate it, you know what I'm saying? To try to, you know, get their name out there. But it was relatable to y'all. For y'all to keep posting. And the people that's going to keep posting, y'all going to see the benefits, for sure. We go see the views go up regardless. If 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 you get zero, uh, if you get one view a video, and you only post once a week, you only go have that one view. You post seven days, you're gonna have seven views. If you get twenty views, come on, y'all do the math. It adds up. If you keep posting, you're gonna get your views, so it's relatable and it makes sense. But the easy mode videos, how is that relatable? If YouTube is hard, it's hard coming up with titles. It's hard posting these videos. It's hard getting on the camera in front of people. It's hard talking to the camera. I mean, being brand new, hopping in, and somebody saying, ooh, easy mode, let me hop on YouTube, it's not for them. They're going to quit. Y'all, we, we, we should not. Try to make things easier in life as far as things. Let me rephrase that. If it comes easy, it's not worth it. If it comes easy, it's not worth it. That's like a, you know, one hit wonder, you know. The grind and the determination you put into what you want, that's what's going to make it worth it. That's the only thing that'll make it worth it. 
Yeah, you can get a big YouTuber, shout you out. You can get a million subscribers and blow up then. But in the long run, yeah, you know, your name's still going to be tied to that person. But I'm, I'm, I'm really trying to figure out how YouTube is easy. If it's still hard for me. If you got over a thousand subscribers, let me know in the comment section how easy was it to get them thousand subscribers. If you got a hundred subscribers, let me know in the comment section how easy it was. Because if it came easy, like I said, are you getting the views? A lot of people haven't posted over 100 videos. And I'm a firm believer in every video, you should get 1% better. So if you go from your first video to your 100th or your first to your 50th, look at them. If you have not changed anything as far as how you do your thumbnails, your titles, your topics, how you talk in the camera, how you look in the camera, if you don't change any of them between 1 through 50, you didn't get 1% better. By, by the 50 video mark, yeah, you should be at 50%. By the 100 video mark, I believe you should be at 100%. But guess what? That doesn't mean you'll be monetized. That doesn't mean you'll be ready. Because at that 100 video, it's like starting all over. Starting all over. YouTube is not on easy mode, y'all. It's not. I'm sorry to tell you. Sorry to disappoint you. Listen to Big Bruh. Listen to Big Bruh. It is not on easy mode. Far from it. I want y'all to at least have 100 plus videos your category before you know you have an opinion on if YouTube is on easy mode or not because after that 100 video you'll see where you at and at that point you would know if it's easy or not there's many many other creators who agree with me I know they do the ones that's been on here for a while? No. No. Easy where? Oh, man. It just became easy as soon as... Nah. Uh -uh. Nope. It ain't luck. We still got experience, y'all. And I want y'all to get experience. Have experience. Post 100 videos. Get 1% better every day. And after you have them 100 videos, come back to this video and let me know how easy... YouTube was. As always, God first. God did. God will continue to do it. And I love y'all. I'll see y'all next video.